Well, uh, it looks like the university might be worthy of an award for its blooms too. Uh, Lucy Kite has joined us in the studio to talk about flowers, Lucy. Yeah, spring more. flowers. Well, specifically crocus or croci or crocuses. <laughs> That's been the debate this afternoon in the office. We sent our cameras over to the University of Leicester, to the Botanic Gardens there at Oadby, because at this time of year, it's just spectacular. They have a 100 square meters display of the vibrant purple flowers now we thought they might be a little bit early this year because it's been really mild of course but in fact they're bang on time and it's probably been quite busy as well that flower today because it does respond to the weather because if it's sunny the flower opens as you might know and then if it's cloudy it closes so it must have been very busy today because the weather's been all over the place there is definitely more to those little flowers that you than you might think because actually they're also part of a research project at the university have a look at this Crocuses are part of a bigger research collection which we have and the research project is involved in looking at the origin of the saffron crocus and if people come along on Sunday they'll be able to see aspects of that research as well as a large number of other spring flowering bulbs which are in our alpine house. He said crocuses. Crocuses, yes, we'll go with that. We'll go with that. They are beautiful. <laughs> now though, are the rumours true? Are we going to get a bit of snow tomorrow? Are we going to be sledging into work?